It is finally official, Checkpoint just announced that GuyArt82 is the recommended version to be running in a production environment. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to upgrade an environment running GuyArt81.20 and we're going to see how to upgrade it to GuyArt82. If you want to deploy uh, GuyArt82 from scratch, you can watch this video that I did some time ago and it's going to cover all the steps required for you to have a uh, checkpoint environment running GuyArt82, okay? Now, if you want to dive deeper, like uh, about the new features and what you might expect on this new version, you can take a look at this document that I'm going to share in the video description. And there is also a uh, kind of uh, attention or oh, warning note from Checkpoint is that uh, Quantum R81.10 uh, it's approaching end of support until March 2026. So they recommend that you upgrade to uh, at least Gaia R81.20 or to Gaia R82. Okay, so let's see how to upgrade an environment running Gaia R81.20. Okay, so this is the deployment that I have. So you can see I only have one uh, security management server and one gateway, and they are both running Gaia R81.20. And I have a basic policy here just allowing everything from uh, my LAN network to the internet and then I have the cleanup rule okay so to begin the upgrade process we're going to use the Gaia portal so first we're going to start with the security management server and then we're going to upgrade uh, the gateway so to do that just make sure that your security management server has internet access and then just go to uh, upgrades status and actions and here what you want to do first is check for updates okay and this is going to just run some validation and see if there is uh, any new feature or package available for your security management server okay in my case i do have so you can see i have here uh major versions okay and also some hot fixes there and we can select the guy r82 clean install upgrade okay and we're going to download while the gateway is downloading the file we're going to do the same thing for the management server so let's go to upgrades status and actions and i don't want to see this new software update experience so i'm just going to say no thanks and i'm going to select here our gaia r82 clean install and upgrade and i'm just going to select download Okay, the download is completed for the management server. So we're going to select it and click on clean install. This install a new machine, accent OS settings and the checkpoint will be overwritten. There will be an automatic reboot. Are you sure you want to continue? Okay, let's proceed. And you can see that it's going to initiating uh, the installation. During the installation process, you might receive this warning saying like, uh, identify that the E1000 driver is in use and it will be deprecated. So we can just continue. Okay, the download is also completed for the gateway, so we're going to select and begin the installation. Yes, let's confirm that. Okay, the installation is completed for the security management server, and as you can see now it says Gaia Portal R82. So let's take a look at it. Okay, I have to go through the first time configuration wizard. Okay, let's continue. Okay, I have to set the password. Okay, that's correct. Now I gotta give it a name. Uh, SMS. Okay, keep the time clock. Okay, secure the gateway. And this is going to be the management server. Okay, address. Okay, let's finish. And it'll start installation. Okay, it looks like we have to do the same thing for the gateway. Okay, let's continue, continue, let's going to set the password. Okay, just confirm the IP address, now I'm going to set the outside interface IP so that the gateway can have access to the internet. Now I'm going to set the gateway host name, okay, confirm the time. Okay, let's select this as a gateway. And now we're going to, so if I had to configure clustering, that's going to be ElasticXL. No. Let's set the activation key. And 
Linux. And let's begin the installation. Okay, the configuration is completed on the security management server and we can see that we have Gaia R82 running. And the next step could be like to see if we have a new hotfix to be installed. So we can check for updates. We need to contact the download setting, validating candidates. And we have this uh, hotfix accumulator recommended as Joom Take 34. And we can download and install this. Okay, so like, okay to start the package installation, machine will automatically reboot. Okay, and we can do the same for the gateway. As for the gateway, we can see it's also running R82. So if we take a look at available updates and check for updates, we can see that we also have some hotfix that can be installed. Okay, so this is it, guys. This is how you can upgrade uh, Gaia R81.20 environment to Gaia R82 using the online upgrade process. So if you took value from this video, don't forget to subscribe, hit the like button, and I'll see you on the next one.